Welcome to my kitchen. Today I am going to be making homemade chicken noodle soup. So I put some water in a large pan and I have a chicken carcass from a chicken that I made yesterday. And I am just going to put this whole chicken carcass in my bowl, in my pot. And what you want is to have the entire chicken carcass covered with water. If you don't have a chicken carcass, you could use chicken breast, chicken thighs, whatever you have. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna just bring this up to a boil and then turn it down and let it simmer for at least one hour. Longer is better. You'll get more flavor from your chicken. So I'll be back after we have the chicken all done. Okay, so my chicken carcass has been simmering for about two and a half hours. I'm just going to dump this in a colander with another bowl underneath it because I want to save all this chicken stock for my soup and just make sure you get that all out okay once you have the chicken carcass drained we're just gonna take the chicken broth that was that we boiled the chicken in pour it back into the bowl If you don't have enough, you can always add some chicken stock or chicken broth from the store. And to that, I am going to add one large chopped up onion. Two chopped up carrots. And two stalks of celery chopped. Then I'm going to add two bay leaves. Two teaspoons of thyme. Two teaspoons of parsley. Two teaspoons of basil. one teaspoon of poultry seasoning one teaspoon of salt and one teaspoon of pepper And you just want to stir that all together, cover it, and let it simmer for 15 to 20 minutes until the carrots are just about tender. Okay, my soup has been simmering for about 15 minutes. My carrots are just about tender. So I'm going to add one cup of wide noodles to my pot. You can add more if you like a lot of noodles. And then while I was waiting for this to simmer, I took my chicken off the bone of my carcass and I have about two and a half cups of chicken. I'm just going to add that. And I'm just going to let this cook for about eight to ten minutes until my noodles are tender okay it's been about eight minutes and our noodles are cooked i just tasted it and i'm just going to add a little more black pepper and a little bit more salt and that's it it's ready to serve if you wanted to thicken it up, you could do some flour and water and thicken it up that way. And just make sure you take your bay leaves out. So far I've only found one. So there is one more in here. And 
and that's it. Simple, easy to make, and smells so good. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, share, and subscribe. That would help me out a great deal. And I will see you on the next one.